you are not going to believe this. I have an Excel table, and I want to insert pictures here and use XLOOKUP and the filter function to look up a picture. Not only that, here's the folder with the pictures, and I have an Excel file right in the middle. When I tell this feature to import these pictures, it'll skip right over that. Now watch this. I'm going to select a single cell, go up to Insert Picture and drop down, and a brand new feature in beta right now in Microsoft 365, Place in Cell. I want Place in Cell this device. Select the first one, hold Shift, select the last one. Notice, no Excel file. Click Insert. That is unbelievable. Equals X lookup. I'm looking up this name, comma, in the product column, comma, and the return array picture. And when I hit Enter, picture. that is amazing. When I change it to Bellin, bam. Not only that, but it gets 100 times better. XLOOKUP can actually have a picture as a lookup value, comma. I'm going to try and match it here and return the price. Bam! When I change this to quad, there it is, my favorite boomerang and the price. Now it gets even better. I want to look up using filter a bunch of records based on a lower and upper price equals filter. I'm going to select the upper left corner of this Excel table. I have the names turned off, comma, and I need to include, based on the price column, two different conditions. In parentheses, I say, hey, price, are you greater than or equal to the lower limit? And there's a second condition. And in logical tests in Excel, the and logical test in math operators is represented by multiplication, the price also has to be less than or equal to the upper limit. Close, close, and when I hit Enter, that is a thing of beauty. If I change this to 40, bam, I get a whole new set of boomerangs. I can say, hey, customer, which one do you want in your price range? All right, X lookup to actually look up a picture. X lookup with a picture lookup value, and of course, our other favorite lookup function, filter works with pictures too. Thanks, Microsoft, and we'll see you next Excel magic trick.